Dear students, in this module, we shall discuss the structure-function relationships of organisms in detail. Dear students, the functions are based on structures. And in living organisms, the structural designs have been developed to match the functional demands. This property or this type of development of structures enables them to play the role and fulfill their job within an organism. यहाँ पे हम एक एग्जाम्पल लेंगे जिसमें हम फ्रॉग के फीडिंग मैकेनिज्म को और उसके अंदर इन्वॉल्व होने वाले स्ट्रक्चर्स और उनके फंक्शंस को आपस में कंपेयर करेंगे और देखेंगे कि किस तरह से स्ट्रक्चर्स अपने फंक्शंस के साथ रिलेटेड हैं इन द फर्स्ट स्टेप जब फीडिंग प्रोसेस एक फ्रॉग का शुरू होता है तो ए फ्रॉग लीप्स फॉर इट्स प्रे When it leaps for prey, it contracts its skeletal muscles, which are attached to its bones of uh, limbs. After receiving the food, food reaches the stomach. Stomach has smooth muscles, which grind and mix the contents of food. After digestion, nutrients are absorbed, and they are absorbed into the blood. Blood flows due to the beating of cardiac muscles of the heart. In all this process, we can see that the structures of muscles have specializations for their functions. For example. the skeletal muscles are evolved and adapted for movement of bones the smooth muscles of digestive tract are specialized for grinding and mixing of the food contents similarly the cardiac muscles are specialized to pump and circulate blood dear students the structure function relationships are not restricted to muscle tissue only but they exist at all levels of biological organization they are found at the tissue level and down from the tissue level they are found at the molecular and cellular cellular and molecular levels we shall take an example again to see that structure function relationships exist at all levels of biological organization beginning with the whole organism we can see that the level of structure function relationships comes down to the system level to the organ level to the tissue level to the cellular level and to macromolecular and macro uh, and molecular levels the muscular system at the system level helps to move the limbs at the organ level we see that these muscles provide are made up of group of muscle tissues these muscle tissues itself are based on the cellular level that is muscle tissue khud cells ka bana hua hai jo ke muscle cells hain aur buniyadi taur par ye contractile hain muscles ke andar jo contractility pai jati hai wo in cells ki contractility par depend karti hai lekin ye jo muscle cells hain inke andar khud aisi units hain ya aisi assemblies hain जिन्हें हम सार्कोमियर्स कहते हैं जो बेसिस हैं कॉन्ट्रेक्शन की दीज सार्कोमियर्स आर देम सेल्स मेड अप ऑफ टू टाइप्स ऑफ प्रोटीन्स विच आर कॉन्ट्रेक्टाइल इन नेचर जिनमें 
سکڑنے اور پھیلنے کی صلاحیت پائی جاتی ہے اور یہ والی پروٹینز مالیکولر بیسز بناتی ہیں اس سارے فینومنا کی جس میں ہم نے ڈسکس کیا کہ انہی پروٹینز کی وجہ سے سیلس کانٹیکٹائل ہیں اس کی وجہ سے ان سیلس کی وجہ سے بننے والا ٹیشو کانٹیکٹائل ہے اور اس ٹیشو سے بننے والے آرگنز جو ہیں وہ کانٹیکٹائل ہیں اور ایز اے ریزلٹ آرگنزم پورے کا پورا موو کر رہا ہے دیٹ از آور ایم فرام دس ہول ایگزامپل وی کین کنکلوڈ دیٹ فنکشنس آر ڈیپینڈنٹ آن دیئر اسٹرکچرس اینڈ دی ویریس اسٹرکچرس ہیو ایوالو ٹو فلفل دی ڈیمانڈس دیٹ اے فیزیولوجیکل پروسیس پریزینٹس